Yo guys, what is up? It's right from 54332 here today I'm bringing you a brand new episode of WWE Supercard. And guys, as you can tell by the thumbnail, the title, and right there in the top right corner, it is Ring Domination for the Hugger, the original Hugger Bailey. Now, um, so I'll show you where the SummerSlam card is a Polo Cruise. Um, the Harden card is, I don't know what it is yet, I haven't looked, I don't care really, I just want it to be a surprise. Then the Elite card is Ember Moon. So we have Ember Moon, which will be the Elite, which I will be grinding on for the next 3 days, 15 hours, 22 minutes and 30 seconds. However. A day and a half of those, I will not be able to play. So we got a day and a half um, to get all the way through Ember Moon. I might be able to play it Saturday night, but yeah. Um, so there is no supercut on Saturday. That video will be uploaded tomorrow, <coughs> as I am going away for the weekend. However guys, let's jump straight in, we are going to be facing Braylon. Um, as you can tell there, there is in the bottom right, there is no recent pool. Um, I've pulled a couple Wrestlemania pools, a Becky Lynch and a, and a Del Rio, but no one, we don't care about them. The only cards we care about are Summer Slams and Hardens. And obviously elite, which we aren't really going to pull. Um, so we just chuck in the rock there, just so. But we lose to a hardened pro baron. Um, we will chuck in a Dolph to take back the rock. And so we still got a left arrow, which is Akum, and a down arrow, which is hardened Shinsuke. Um, our Harden Baron Corbin now is pro, a uh, perfect pro. Um, so Austin takes doesn't won't take the rock, as the rock is too powerful. I think. Oh no, so called does take the rock. However, Aiken will take back Dwayne, the rock, Johnson. The rock doing something that it will never do, and that is job. <laughs> And, um, yeah, so this should pick us, and it does. It picks us up the victory. Four, two, five. Um, I haven't really been playing Road to Glory. Uh, sorry, Ring Dom. Yet, because I didn't know what time I'll be here starting to record and what not. However, we do have two shards on Apollo Crews. Um. Which is helpful. So, we'll be using all five of our games on this. Um, if we're lucky, we'll get a sixth one in, so we'll just jump straight back in. Um, and, yeah. No, guys, I want to talk about Raw and SmackDown. I haven't, I haven't watched it either. This week, um, however, I'm pretty sure I read that the Fashion Police, Tyler Breeze, and Fandango are number one contenders for the tag team championships, <coughs> which is surprising, but I like that um, because. I've said pretty much since Tyler Breeze has been on the main roster, he deserves a push. Um, but, you know, it's just a bit of a shame that's taken him this far and no one really takes him seriously anymore. <coughs> but, yeah, stuff happens and whatever. So we'll take Dolph with our pro Corbin. Um,. So this should pick us up with a victory. Then we'll take 
the band who fears Grimm, Kurt Hawkins, with our pro SummerSlam, Luke Gallows. Um, I really hope that this hardened card gets me to a pro. Um, I don't think it will, but we pick, we, we win this 8-1. Um, I mean, I really don't care if it gets me to, if it's a hardened pro or not. It's just another hardened card. Um, that elite though, of Ember Moon, I really hope I can get that. Um, because that will help boost me up to, I think, hardened plus. Maybe hardened plus plus, but, um... It is obviously Apollo Crews right there. I, I was 100% the first one I pulled. The first shard I pulled, sorry, was Apollo or A P O L. And the disappointment on my face um, was just very disappointing. Um, I mean, because he's not a pro. Pretty sure he's not a pro. Um, I did have a look to make sure he wasn't a pro. I couldn't find him, so I'm guessing he. I haven't pulled him yet. But yeah, um, the reason it's disappointing that I have Apollo Cruz is because I don't like him. Um, and the thing is, if it's right now, because I'm at the point I'm at hardened. I need hardened card, or I need SummerSlam plus uh, SummerSlam Pro cards, um, and I'm not getting these with the SummerSlam event, um, which is a little bit of a shame. So we will just take AJ with our Dolph, but yeah. Um, I mean, an AJ now, an AJ Pro would be cool. Um, a Luke Gallo, uh, a Carl Anderson, sorry, would be cool. Um, he's really the only card I want in SummerSlam. That's just a solo card. Um, just so I can have the club. But obviously, as an event card, he was a... I think it was last ring dom, if not he was the last team ring dom, um, though not yes, last, not last, not yesterday, but the last one, so last week or the week before. Um, we also guys, I should add this in the most recent pool, but we pulled a WrestleMania manager Zeb Coulter which gives us 105 power, so we now have also a Harley race manager which gives us 105 toughness. So, that is good. Um, I only just remembered about that just then. We also have a legendary fusion, which will finish in ten day, uh, ten hours and thirty minutes. Um, so we can get a Sheamus, a Bret Hart, a Jim Neidhart, Page, or a Vince McMahon. So. Yeah, um, I will bring that in the next, in tomorrow's episode, with that fusion. Um, it's not really something, anything special, but, you know, it finishes roughly at 6.30. So, tomorrow's episode will probably be recorded about 8.30, 9 o'clock. Um, so, there won't be much time difference, it'll be probably be at... 12 hours on the upload difference, but yeah, um, I'm only releasing to like Saturday's episode tomorrow because I don't really want to schedule an episode for Saturday for the fact that it will be a day behind. So I thought if I smashed this Friday, tomorrow's one, uh, Saturday's tomorrow, there is still an episode. An extra episode during the event um, then there will be one on Monday um, which is the last 
couple of hours before, so we lose to Baron Corbin with Roman. However, we will take Roman with our Shinsuke. So, which is the last. Normally, I do with about three hours remaining, um, which is just an update. Um, hopefully, by then, I can get the Ember Moon on to on video. But at this point, I just I just hope I can pull her before time runs out. We will take our the, their SummerSlam Pro AJ with our Harden Pro Baron Corbin. Now, guys, I do have something for you, which will definitely be happening hopefully in tomorrow's episode as well. So we pick up the victory five to four. Um. Which is a guaranteed hardened. Um, I only have 200 and something games left to get our first. That. 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 Come on, give me a shard. Nope, we don't pull a shard. So, this is obviously going to be the hardest grind I've ever done. But before we jump into our last game. We'll hit my cards. As you can tell, Carmella is now my champion. Um, so we'll hit ladder rewards. We have 300 and, uh, 3,756 games to play, which is 244 games, which I will get sometime tomorrow. Um, hopefully I can get that by tonight, uh, by tomorrow morning when I do. The first recording, because um, I don't really want to split it up into two parts, because then it just means that the video gets out later, which means there's less of a chance of it actually going up. Um, <laughs> why? Because at the same time, I've got to upload a FIFA video tomorrow as well. I'm hoping I'll upload two of my two FIFA videos tomorrow, which, um, yeah. So. Now guys, I do want to say if you, if you are a fan of FIFA, go check out those two series. We have in the Foot Draft, um, an Ultimate Team series, and a uh, Whole City Career Mode. Um, now, I don't support Whole City, I'm a Man United fan, but yeah, um, I explained why and whatever, so go over and check those two series out. Um, also, if you haven't watched my upload schedule video, go and also check that one out. That will bring you up to date on everything that happens, what days are guaranteed for videos. Um, but like I said, obviously if, they're, if I'm busy, I will try and get that out the day before instead of the day after, But or I'll just schedule them. So, but for Supercut, it's a bit harder, and everything isn't live, but if it's not an event, and I'm just um, doing updates, and what not, I don't want you, I want you. It's going to be a little easier. But, we pick up this victory again, 5 to 4. Hopefully, we can pull a shard on this last game, and... Um, as I don't want to just make this video about 14 minutes long, we'll go in and check a couple more things out. And we're waiting on network. We pull a shard. Come on, be a no, it's not a corner. And we get an Emma. So, guys, we also have a king in two minutes and 30 seconds I will do another match but guys we have a king of the ring which I'm actually really surprised about um, I started it sometime yesterday I didn't regen my energy at all until about only because I was out of energy until about four o'clock this afternoon which was three hours ago which was a good 16 17 hours that we were unenergized but we're still in the top eight I went on 
about four o'clock, went to play my games and regen, and we were sitting eighth. Now, to use that, this is probably the worst I've actually gone in a King of the Ring. Um, except for the last King of the Ring, I think I finished fifth or sixth, which got us one WrestleMania card. No, we got last game we got into the quarterfinal, and we were eighth. Oh no, I think we were 6th or 7th, which we got eliminated from, um, but, and you've just crashed. Thank you for that. So we'll open up champion, uh, sorry, supercard once again, and yeah. Now guys, I do want to bring one thing up, the new WWE game that got released on Android, which was Tapmania is not out yet in Australia so I went to do an episode for that yesterday as Tony Pizza Guy and Super Zone Barbecue released an episode for that um, I thought cool there's a new WWE game I'll go check it out because I check out every WWE game but I went on couldn't find it went on my phone couldn't find it and just assumed that it wasn't out after doing a bit of research on I think it was Tony Pizza Guy's episode of live stream that he did and in one of the comments they said that it's not available in every country so that obviously means America only but do we have an extra ring dom? I think we do in 30 seconds but we are waiting on network so, now guys, I am trying to make this episode a little longer, as the last couple have, they've roughly been about 20 minutes or something, but, yeah. We are waiting on network again. Alrighty guys, I will quickly run you through my deck. Like I said, I haven't really pulled anything special. Um, I haven't pulled any SummerSlam cards. No, I am working to get my Cesaro to every to max, just because I don't know if he will be AJ or if he will be like so he can fit into my team decks, which I think he has to be AJ. But guys, in our WrestleMania, we have pulled an Alberto Del Rio and a Becky Lynch and a Neville. Um, Neville was my King of the Ring yesterday, or my last King of the Ring rewards. I pulled a Becky Lynch sometime yesterday, or the day before. Then I pulled Alberto Del Rio just before. And I still haven't pulled my SummerSlam card, uh, my Hard End card yet. So hopefully that comes soon. I've played, I think, 300 games. Since I've been in hardened tier, probably not even that. About 200, I think I've played. And yeah, so we'll do one last game before we leave. And um, yeah, so hopefully I don't get my hardened pool tonight. Hopefully I get it on camera tomorrow. But if I get uh, my hardened pool tonight, um, like board pool, I mean, I will. There won't be a reaction to it. <laughs> because I'll almost probably be, be in bed playing it on my phone whilst watching or playing FIFA or whatever or watching someone live stream Supercard like I always do but yeah so we lose our AJ to Baron Foreskin but we will take him back Actually, we'll do 105 power. Um, we will take back AJ first with our Nakamura, just to make sure. Because I don't I'm really don't know if I want to take the Baron, just because I don't want to lose. Um, so yeah, so that Randy Orton is going to beat Shinsuke with an RKO out of nowhere. We will use that Baron Foreskin to 
to take Randy Orton, which is guaranteed. Even if Randy was the proc again, we would still beat him, but I don't think he does. Dolph will lose to Randy Orton. I'm 90% sure. No, he does. Oh, yes, he does. He loses, which gets us to 1, 2, 3, 4. Three guaranteed at this point in time. And we've picked up the victory 5, 2, 4 once again. Um, so here's the Baron for Corbin for Art. Max. But that is perfectly fine with me because we've put our Luke Gallows in, which gets us 5, 2, 4. Hopefully we can pull a shot on this and end the video on a high note. If not, that was a bit of a shame. I should have just stopped recording at the end. We pull a shard and it is a legendary table to go well with our Devon Dudley's WrestleMania that we always seem to be pulling. Um, no, we only get one shard there, but we started the episode out with two shards. We now have five. So for the next 12 hours, I will be doing the grind to hopefully get up to our hardened card. I'll definitely be at hardened in the morning or get it on camera one of the two. Hopefully by then though, I'll be a little bit through the hardened card and um, yeah. Other than, other than that guys, this brings us to the end of today's episode. If you enjoyed today's episode, hit that like button if you're new to the channel. Hit that subscribe button and comment what your thoughts were on today's episode. Also, guys, if you'd like to find out what video, what music I use in my videos, go and check those out. Those guys are the link, the first and second link on my channel. Now, guys, the reason I say second link, um, and if there's only one type of music on there that I use in the exact same of all my videos. Is because I haven't downloaded any of the other music, but next tomorrow's episode there will be new music, if not in today's episode. But like I said, guys, go check those guys out. Look up Rewind Remix. That is the first link. The second link I can't quite remember who they are, but just go check them out. They'll both be there. And um, yeah, other than that, guys, this is Ratman signing out. Peace.